come on, let's come around over here. I wanna, I really wanna get this reverse backflip. Let me see if I can line it up better. And there we go. Nice reverse flip. Hello and welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Two Can Plays Monster Jam Steel Titans 2. And today we are going to be playing as a dragon. I was going to say Monster Mutt, but we're not playing Monster Mutt. We're playing as dragon. I think Monster Mutt Poodle was throwing me off there for a second. We are playing as Dragon Overcast and that is a viewer request, but from a ghost SRT. And a ghost asked for a quick shout out. So I'm definitely giving him a shout out ghost. Thank you for putting in a viewer request. If you guys have a, a request of a truck that you would like to see me play as, don't be afraid to leave a comment below and I will be more than happy to play as the truck that you would like to play as, as long as it is in Steel Titans. Whoa, Steel Titans 1 or Steel Titans 2. I do have all the DLCs. So I've got the inverse, the fire and ice, whatever your heart can imagine. Oh, come on. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, Ice Cream Man's right on my tail. I am in first place right now, which is amazing because this is one of the hardest tracks in the game. And I'm not sure how exactly I managed to stay or get into first place here. Let's see if I can stay in first place because like I said, this track is not easy, but Ice Cream Man is right on my tail. Oh, come on. Now I am super glad for this request because Dragon Overcast is actually one of my favorite trucks and I have featured him on the channel in the past a couple of times. And every time I feature him on the channel, the video seems to ah, not do so well. And I'm not sure why exactly. I'm not sure why there is no love for Dragon Overcast, but uh, apparently nobody really likes Dragon Overcast. Maybe they just like the regular dragon better. I don't know. Leave a comment. Tell me why you prefer Dragon over Dragon Overcast or vice versa. And while I'm yapping, uh, Ice Cream Man has taken over my first place spot. Ho! Oh, but my my soup, my my creature, my crazy creature ability came in super handy right there. It allowed me to get a little bit of extra distance on that jump right there. And it let me get ahead. No, 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 no. Ahead of Ice Cream Man. Nice. We're back in the first place. How many more we got? We got seven more. I was supposed to turn there and I didn't. Doggone it. No. Oh, geez. Well, so much for that. <laughs> tried I tried oh come on come on go go dragon go go dragon go go <laughs> there we go yeah I was in first place for a long time <laughs> yeah you know what I I don't mind the crazy creature ability that lets you get a little bit of extra air off of your jumps uh, it, it's nice uh, maybe not the best I mean the defender ability is way way overpowered Ho! Yo, guys, what are you doing? <laughs> Yo, come on, come on. Oh, no, no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, the defender ability is definitely the most overpowered out of all of them. But the crazy creature where you get a little bit of extra hang time off the jump. Oh, they're crashing. They're crashing. Can I get ahead of them? Can I get ahead of them? Oh, man, second place. Wow, that was actually a pretty good way to start the episode. All right, first head to head is going to be here in Indianapolis. It looks like we're going to be going against Alien Invasion first off. There is Dragon Overcast. See what I mean, though? It looks so cool. I like the silver look to it, and it contrasts really well with the uh, the gold, or not gold, but yellow lettering of Dragon. And there is the silver alien invasion with the green marching ants on the side. It's so cool. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Perfect start. I love it. And we come back around this way and up and over. Oh, don't go too hard around that corner. And so we're doing official length. So we've got three laps. I'm sorry, not official, normal, normal length. So we got three laps to do this in. So it kind of starts off with uh, us on the side and then we've got kind of this long oval down the chicane and we got to do a turn. It's kind of, I think, I think what uh, Wagner said is a St. Louis style. 
uh, but not quite. It's just kind of a big oval. Nice. And since this is a stadium, we've got a bigger bracket this time. It's a 16 bracket instead of an 8. Nice. So Alien Invasion is out of the way. Next up is going to be Megalodon. And let's look at the other side of the bracket. We've got Great Clips, Mohawk Warrior, Son of a Digger, Jurassic Attack, and Captain's Curse. I think it's probably going to be Son of a Digger in the finals. But let's find out. We've got to get through Megalodon first. Yeah, that fire breathing looks so cool. <laughs> Nice. And there's Megalodon. Da -dun -da -dun -da -dun. It's the battle of the crazy creatures. Come on, let's go. Wiggle those tires for good luck. Three, two, one, go. Perfect start. That's my problem. You know, last episode I did Monster Mutt and I didn't do all that well in my um, head to heads. And the reason why is because I didn't wiggle my tires for good luck. It's my fault because I wasn't wiggling. <laughs> Let that be a lesson for you all. You must wiggle your tires for good luck. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. And don't believe in superstitions like that, guys. Just just don't. <laughs> anyway, we're off to a great start here against Megalodon. Uh, what are we? Oh, it's only it's only about a second head start ahead of him. But, you know, that's all right. That's all right. We got him. We got him. Even if it was only a second lead. Nice. Megalodon is out of the way. And son of a digger to nobody's surprise it has moved on to the next to the semifinals and we're going to be going against Bakugan Dragonoid. I'm sure it's still going to be son of a digger in the finals. Let's find out. Yeah, burninate them. <laughs> burn, burn. <laughs> Little Homestar Runner reference there, Wagner, just for you. <laughs> Oh, got to wiggle those tires for good luck. There is Bakugan Dragonoid, also one of my favorite trucks. I don't know why Dragonoid was not in a crazy creature. That would seem like a crazy creature, doesn't it? I don't know, but it's a defender. All right, three, two, one, and go. Perfect start. Come on, let's go. Now, I'm almost positive that uh, Dragonoid is going to be in uh, uh, Showdown once it comes out, but we haven't seen any promotional footage with Dragonoid yet. Um, but, you know, like I said, Dragonoid is almost a, a shoe in to be in Showdown. I am excited. Later this week, I'm going to release a video going over all of the new promotional material. If you watch any of the Monster Jam live streams, they have some ads for Showdown. It's got a little bit of extra footage and the official milestone TikTok has got some uh, extra footage on it. And so, yeah, it's kind of exciting to look at stuff trickling out here and there new info coming little by little yeah look at that son of a digger in the finals who knew right who would have guessed <laughs> that's all right because i'm wiggling my tires for good luck which means i will be victorious <laughs> and there is son of a digger that's such a cool truck too i love son of a digger all right, here we go. Ready? Three, two, one, and go. Perfect start. We're going to blow some smoke. Or not smoke, but flames. Blow some fire. <laughs> Got to remember to do that during my freestyle run. <laughs> yeah. All right, we are in second place. Maybe I got a little too cocky there. <laughs> oh, we caught up. Oh, I just got to make this turn a little bit better. We got one more lap to go. I don't mind the official length. I think I think the official. I'm not sorry, not the official, the normal length. I don't mind the normal length runs of these, but the uh, the extended length is just it's too much. It's too much. <laughs> yeah, ladies and gentlemen, your Indianapolis head to head racing champion. Toucan plays driving dragon overcast. Ah! <sighs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to switch things up a little bit. We're going to do time destruction first instead of two wheel skills. We'll do two wheel skills next time. I'm sorry, not next time, but in the next series, the next stadium that we go to. Man, Dragon Overcast is so cool. It's such a cool truck. Guys, I love monster trucks. I'm sorry, but I do. <laughs> Three, two, one, and go. Perfect start. Let's get some blimps and some crush cars. Whoa, and that's a 13 times combo. That wasn't a very big combo. Um, oh, come on. Don't ruin the combo. There we go. We get some more porta potties, some more boxes. Let's come down and get the fences over here. The chicken crates. 
more fences. We'll come up here. We'll get some more boxes. Oh, porta potties. No, 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 no. Oh, good. Whew, I got that crushed bus. No, the bus wasn't enough. See, the buses and the cars. I know I've complained about this so many times, but the buses and the cars, they don't pop my my uh, combo meter up enough to to be worthwhile. They just don't. They, I, I And I know why, because it, it's easy to abuse because you can just run over them back and forth, back and forth and get the combo meter super, super high. I get it, but it's still obnoxious. Whoa, big air, which gave me absolutely nothing. Hey, but I still have a 24 times combo. Let's get the blimps off the back of the container. I got oh, almost all four, six, almost six of them. Come on, let's hit this. Oh, box truck, got the box truck. Didn't quite get uh, all the blimps that I wanted though. Oh, well, let's turn around. We'll come back around this way. We're already in first place. So everything we're getting now is just gravy. Let's get a flame for the audience. <laughs> we'll get more blimps and jump right over all of the box trucks. It's okay. We got a bunch of these dice blocks we're gonna get. We'll come around and get some outhouses over here. 22 times combo. We'll come around to the backflip container and we'll get, whoa, we'll get a couple blimps. That was a weird kind of corkscrew backflip, but that's okay. Come around over here. Oh, <laughs> nice little stoppy onto the cars. And we'll come back up over this way. We're running out of time. We got two seconds left. Oh, and that's all she wrote. I was going to come over here and try and get all these boxes, but oh well, we're out of time. That was fun. That was fun. All right. I'm feeling some Las Vegas head to head, some J-Hook style racing in the world finals. <sighs> I'm so sad that they don't have Monster Jam at the Thomas, not, not Thomas and Mac. What is it? The, uh, the Sam Boyd Stadium. Thomas and Mac is the other UNLV stadium. That's where they have the basketball. And, and, and I don't know why. I mean, they, I would assume that they could do Monster Jam. That probably is where they do Monster Jam nowadays. All right, three, two, one, and let's go. But it's not as big. The Thomas and Mac Center, like I said, that's where they do basketball. Uh, and it's probably not as big as the Sam Boyd Stadium. So it's more of an arena than it is a stadium, which is unfortunate. But, you know, at least they're still in Vegas. All right, round one done. Moving on to round two. Who's it going to be? We're going to be going against Earthshaker. Let's look at the other side of the bracket. So we've got Alien Invasion, Avenger, Higher Education, and Monster and Mapoodle. Of course, you know, I'm going to be rooting for my boy Avenger. But uh, yeah, I think Avenger is probably going to take it all the way. Let's see. Well, I say all the way. He's going to make it to the finals, and then I'm going to beat the pants off of him. <laughs> but first, we've got to get through <laughs> Earthshaker. There he is. <laughs> We'll say that Tristan England is still driving our taker. Three, two, one, and go. Man, what do you think? Is is uh, Digatron going to be in Showdown? I hope Digatron isn't going to be in Showdown. Probably, most likely, is going to be a DLC pack, which, yeah, that's unfortunate because, you know, everybody knows that Digatron is going to be in high demand. And, uh, whoa, that was going to be a huge backflip. But, yeah, everybody knows that Digatron is going to be in high demand, and so everybody would be willing to pay a little bit extra for Digatron. <sighs> like I said, that's unfortunate because it would be nice if it was in the base pack, but eh, we'll see. We'll see. All right. Avenger moved on. We moved on. We're going to be going against Megalodon. It'll be the battle of the crazy creatures one more time. Let's go. Now, they've got to include some sort of a Las Vegas track in a showdown like they have to <laughs> there's just even if it's not sam boyd they've got to have some kind of vegas track in showdown right right i don't know i don't know they have they released how many different arenas they were gonna have i don't think they have something tells me like 52 but i don't think that's right there's no way 52 nah i don't know i don't remember i don't remember them saying anything Wow, Megalodon didn't even stand a chance. None of these guys have really stood a chance. I love the J-Hook style race, but it's, it seems pretty easy. <laughs> All right, Megalodon's out of the way. Come on, Avenger, you can do it. Yeah, it's me versus Avenger. Let's go. Roar. <laughs> All right, Jim, I've got your number. Come on. I'm going to take you out. Man, I sure hope Avenger is in showdown too. Ha. Uh, I think it's gonna be, I think it's gonna be, but 
you just never know until they officially announce it. You never, never know. Come on around the corner. And we have officially won World Finals. <laughs> Yes, thank you, thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, your Las Vegas World Finals head-to-head -head racing champion, Toucan Plays in Dragon Overcast. Woohoo! <laughs> All right, time for some skills here in Las Vegas. Let's do it. Two wheel skills starring me, <laughs> Dragon Overcast. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Going down Titan's Lane. <laughs> Not Thunder Alley, Titan's Lane. Let's pop up onto the pod and get a nice little moonwalk, which they're not gonna count. So that's okay. It was kind of a, a poor moonwalk anyway, so let's 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 come down. I wonder, can I get a moonwalk or a stoppy into this little puddle right here? Uh, I can't. It's not a very big puddle, but hey, you know what? I got a stoppy and a moonwalk out of it. Let's get another big air sky wheelie and we'll come down off the pod. Whoa, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Almost got a moon flip there. Nice, big air again. No, no, not a big air, but another moonwalk. I'm getting all kinds of moonwalks there. Nice little bicycle, which uh, they counted towards my second attempt. That's okay. Look at that bicycle. Oh, baby, nice. We'll get another big air sky wheelie backflip. Completely unrealistic. It's a um, Steel Titans 2 backflip, but hey, it works. It works. I gotta say, I hope they really do something cool to differentiate between skills and freestyle. Because here in, in Steel Titans, there's really not much difference between skills and just freestyle. You can do all kinds of crazy freestyle moves and they still count. <laughs> you know, there's not really a whole big difference between skills and freestyle other than the fact that freestyle is timed and skills is not you know um it's, it's really up to me to kind of role play the fact that i'm i'm doing a skills instead of freestyle um which is fine i can do that but i'd rather not have to you know what i mean i'd rather there be some some cool way to to differentiate between skills and uh and freestyle you know let's go for a reverse backflip we're gonna do something wild and crazy oh the <laughs> and it failed big risk big reward big fail <laughs> nice nice power out nice bicycle double bicycle four times bicycle on that one crazy nice big air sky wheelie nice oh i did a stoppy onto one wheel but they didn't count it of course and i, I flipped it over on the front anyway Come on, let's come around over here. I wanna, I really wanna get this reverse backflip. Let me see if I can line it up better. And there we go. Nice reverse flip uh, with a stoppy. I don't think there was a stoppy in there, but hey, that was a cool reverse flip. I like it. Nice sky a wheelie. Whoa, come on, come on. No, no, no. Oh no. Oh, five times combo. That put me into second place with 10, a perfect 10 for the score. Uh, nice little wheelie coming right off the pod. Whoa, into a nice little endo. Come on, get it up. There we go. Uh, they call it a power out. Well, we'll go with that power out. Sure, why not? We're getting some of these beacons. Nice, 11 times combo, 12 times combo, 13 times combo. Nice, a nice little uh, slap wheelie there at the very, very end. We'll get a nice big air backflip. No, <laughs> no, no combos after that. Five times combo there, and that is gonna be all she wrote. That was a great freestyle for world finals. I'll take that, I'll take that. Now I'm feeling some derby circuit races. So we're gonna go to skirmish that's here in the highlands. And of course a derby circuit is where half are going one way, half are going the other. Of course, backward Bob looked like he's going my direction and he's not because he's backwards. Which way is he going? I don't know, <laughs> he can't tell. Oh no, and I've got Bo Mohawk Warrior, Great Clips Mohawk Warrior who's pushing me off to the side because he is an overpowered defender. <sighs> what a turkey. <laughs> no, there we go. Okay, good. Ooh, I thought I was gonna go off the side there for a second. Um, 
Okay, I'm gonna go up whatever ramp he's not. So he's going down the center lane, so we're gonna go up to the top lane. Uh, he's gonna push everybody out of his way. He's such a big bully. All right, we've got Junkyard Dog, who's totally getting bullied by uh, poor, now poor Junkyard Dog is getting bullied by Great Clips Mohawk Warrior. All right, come on, I've got two boosts. I gotta find the right place to use them. I'm gonna go on the inside lane here. Maybe they're gonna get smacked by, nope, I'm gonna get smacked. Whoa, I'm gonna get smacked by two people. I think that was uh, Stone Crusher and Backwards Bob, I believe. Or maybe it was Pirate's Curse, I don't know. Uh, all right, well, there's my second boost. Oh, jeez, that was actually helpful for me. Thank you. Oh, no, that was not. <laughs> so one, one of those bumps was actually quite helpful for me. The other one was not helpful at all. It kind of pushed me up the wall. And, uh, oh man, we're, we're kind of sunk now. Yeah. Okay, I've got somebody who's gonna come around the corner. I know it, and they're gonna smack right into me, aren't they? Nope, nope, we're okay. All right, good. We're in fifth place. That is so bad. <laughs> okay, I've got two boosts. There's Pirate's Curse. We've got one more lap to go. Let's use a boost right here. No! Whoa, Bob! <laughs> no, 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 not the wall, not the wall. That was a bad place to boost. Just FYI, that's a bad place to boost. <laughs> you don't want to boost right there. Oh, man. All right. No, Pirate's Curse, you stay away from me. <laughs> Uh, all right, coming around this corner. Who was that? Was that Bob? I don't think that was Bob. All right, here we go. Coming into the home stretch here. I think we're going to end up in fifth place because I think Bob, don't you crash into me, you turkey. All right. Yeah, I think Bob is going to end up right here. Uh, he's, he's right over there. There he is. <laughs> well, that was fun. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so much for joining me. I really do appreciate it. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Check out the video that you see on your screen right now. And hey, we'll, we'll see you guys on the flip side later. Nice. Oh, dragon with the flames. He's gonna burn all of these cabins. Bye everybody. <laughs>